hey guys greetings how you doing i hope you are doing well welcome to vinyl tv if you are new to this channel and if you are please consider subscribing thank you very much indeed for stopping by thank you very much indeed for clicking i want to show you what we got here we got this gear this is hp dash jet plus 4120 this printer is simple multitasking it's triple in one is multifunctional in the sense that you can copy scan and print from this printer is essentially home printing this printer is nice gear dope technology here is the scanner okay i want to show you some of the function for this printer the power cable is at the back okay so here is the power cable for this printer it goes in here okay the rest is plugged into the okay so this is the power cable okay so the power cable goes in here okay this printer if you want to use this printer without wireless you need to get usb cable unfortunately this printer did not come with a usb cable it does not come with it so but i got one at home which i'm going to show you but you can get the usb cable via amazon.co.uk can get it from ebay it's universal hp can use it canon can use it epson various printers can use it i want to show you what it looks like this is the usb cable okay so with this cable you connect it here okay and the rest the other section goes to your pc goes to the laptop okay i have my laptop let me show you where it goes so this section okay goes to your laptop goes here oh, okay it's for you to be able to use this printer okay i'm gonna take this off i'll take this off we don't need it right now Now, what I want us to do, okay, like I said, I'm going to plug this printer back on and for us to see some of the function from this printer. Okay, so this printer is using 305 ink cartridges, black and color. That color consists of red, blue, and yellow. Okay, like I said earlier, this is the scanner. I want to show you, so you turn this printer on and off from this button here so this is the on and off button okay this is to copy black this is to copy color this is called LCD screen and inside this LCD screen you see the gauge for the ink cartridges you can see the ink cartridges right now the gauge is full okay the ink cartridges is inside the this is the gauge okay this zero is just to when you select the function like copy it show you how many copies you want to select okay you can see the wi-fi sign is going up and down okay with this is the wi-fi here it's flashing right now blue okay this blue that is flashing just to tell you that it's not yet connected to network once it's connected it will be steady on it will be steady blue this is to alert i mean information this is alert and this is to cancel okay what we want to do right now is to connect this printer to a wi-fi network you can see this wi-fi light is flashing okay and the power uh, the ink okay is here so you load the ink open this container okay and the ink will come out in the middle okay for you to load it check my previous video see how we load this ink cartridges it's using 305 like i said we we'll close it right now okay and what we want to do is to connect this printer to wi-fi network okay to connect this printer to wi-fi network we need to go to our mobile device okay this is my mobile phone okay so on your mobile device what we need to do is um you go to 
Play Store. Okay, go to your Play Store on your mobile device, and once you are in, inside the Play Store, in, in Play Store, the next thing you need to do is to type in, type in HP Smart App. If you type HP Smart App, it will show. This is my HP Smart App. You need to download this Smart App on your phone. Okay, so download HP Smart App. It's already downloaded on my phone. So I need what I need to do now is click open. Okay, right now it's open. What we need to do right now is you see about here about C plus with circle. Type on it click on it it will start searching for available printer as is searching then click add printer okay or you can go back okay click okay i think i need to also make sure that my wi-fi is on okay and the wi-fi is on right now so we'll go back to hp smart app and also uh i need to cancel off the network from my mobile device sometimes it will interfere so i'm gonna remove all the network from my device and work with wi-fi only so we go to hp smart app okay and what we need to do is search for available printer okay as you're searching for available printer click add to find new printer, Wi-Fi Direct, turn on location, click OK. We go back. We try again. And also you need to make sure that printer is on. Click add printer. Here we go. Right now, HP DeskJet. So you need to put the location so that you pick up the location. HP DeskJet Plus. Okay, is this is the printer that is available. Right now, what we need to do is to put the password for this printer. So initially, it was asking my location was turned off on this mobile device. So you need to put the location on so that you pick up the available printer. So right now, we need to connect this printer to Wi-Fi network. Okay. So right now. What I need to do is to put the Wi-Fi details for my home network. Okay, I have the details somewhere. Okay, yeah, I have. So I got the details here. So what I'm going to do is to type in the details. Okay, then we we'll go from there. And when you put the details, you make sure you cross check it again, make sure the information you are putting is correct. So you go back and check. I'm happy with it. So what we need to do right now is click continue, click continue. It will ask you to turn the Bluetooth on, click continue, okay. HP smart app to enable Bluetooth. Yes, allow. Right now is finding this printer. What is doing right now is finding this printer found. Okay. The next thing is preparing the printer. 
okay and once this printer is found and prepared this blue light will stop flashing okay right now it's asking us to press the information press the flashing information button on your printer so you can see information button is flashing here okay so what we need to do is press it like it's instructed okay is preparing the printer assessing the network is the next printer prepared the next thing is is obtaining an ip address for my home network okay so it's obtaining and actually you can see this blue is connected to wi-fi because the blue light is stop flashing it's steady on right now it's already connected already so it's still obtaining ip address on my mobile device but from the what we can see here this blue light is no longer flashing it's connected already to the network here we go printer connected to net wi-fi wi -Fi network you can see printer is connected and if you look over here i want to bring the camera close if you look over here you can see this wi-fi is steady on it's no longer flashing and also on the mobile device you tell you printer connected to wi-fi can see this blue light i was telling you earlier that was flashing is no longer flashing so from the mobile device app you click continue right now it's connecting to hp service okay it's getting the information needed you can see okay the next thing you need to do connect printing service click continue click continue click continue okay if you want to register for hp service or register for your printer you put your details okay you create account or sign in if you have one this is tutorial so what i need to do is skip warranty and account activation it will ask you don't miss out on automatic print warranty so you put your details if you like but this is tutorial so i skip warranty and account activation okay right now setup complete let's print so actually this printer right now is complete you can see dash jet plus 4100 series so if you want to print a document right now you can print a document or to skip printing page so you skip okay print from other device send link not now here we go so this printer right now will show up here okay okay so this printer is ready okay from the app it was telling us hp dash jet plus is ready okay so you can scan do a lot of things from this printer this is how to connect this printer to wi-fi network okay if you're happy with this tutorial please do consider to subscribe it help us to grow don't worry about the um, a bit of um, time wasted on when it was asking about the location so sometimes you need to activate the location on your mobile device so that you will be pick up the printer stretch away okay this is how to connect this printer or set up to wi-fi network please do consider to subscribe thank you help us to grow thank you